Lost Valley time. One of the probably the most memorable level. One of the most memorable memorable levels of the game. Just because of the T-Rex. Not really that much fun. Just because you have to kill them. You can ignore them, but it adds so much RNG, like luck in this run. It's not worth it. And yeah, we can spawn T-Rex. And then when he's attacking me or running towards me, I'm gonna backflip on this. Off, but this is most of the time um, safe spot. Only if you get knocked off, you might get hit. But oh, yeah, nice idea. Hail. Or you can run into the tunnel where the T Rex died. That's one place as well. This raptor can be uh, ignored basically completely. Really don't need it. And then you just hop back and do a running jump with it, like an uh, with a grab all the way to the wa in the water. I'm gonna collect some shotgun shells at this level. <laughs> Get these two secrets out of the way. Also, if you cannot climb up, Sometimes your position is bad. You will not climb up. Let's see if I can get it. Yeah. I guess you won't climb up. So you just go all the way to the right and back. Now you can drop into water or uh, try to do a jump here. Whatever you prefer, really. And the third secret. This level, so this game has 45 secrets. It averages three per level, but this level has five. And then some level has two. If you have almost full health, you can grab this one and drop. Or if you're high health, uh, low health, you just jump on uh, this one. Remember with grab, because if you don't press grab and you hit the wall, if there's a slope and a wall, and you hit the wall at the right frame and position, you can clip into it. And that pushes Lara all the way on the top of the map and falling down. So you wanna make sure you grab, because then you can't bonk on the wall. 
you have to stumble into the wall in order to do that glitch. It's extremely easy to do in uh, Sap Obelisk of Kamun and City Cistern. That's the word. So here, running jump and then jump on a third step. Or you can go on the edge and hop back. That's the another easy way. Backwards. And we have two more secrets for this level. Get down any way you want, really. And then you can do whatever you want for this as long as you make it over and you can do a jump from here to here I grab this one now And there's a bug on PC version of TR1 where if you draw guns instantly after using a key the game doesn't re register it as a key using easy key usage so don't draw guns instantly one frame after um, if you happen to do it and like let's say this lever didn't work we just go on the tile where the key is and then without guns you would do that for these key holes because you are not sure which one of them you glitch just go on the tile where the keyhole is without guns and you will make it that's how you can skip the shimmy part Curve jump loses around like 15% health. No shotgun here. No more. It looks like 15 20% health. But if you have that, you can definitely just jump down. But there's no more risks to die, or you should not, you shouldn't die on anything anymore. I wanna use the shotgun for next raptors because they're a bit annoying sometimes. And we are through the Gwalabek. 